We're talking about knowledge of the future in movies. In this clip, I'll cover an item from Monster Dog. This is from 1984, starring Alice Cooper. Alright, so I did some other videos on this movie. You can see them on my YouTube channel, Easter Egg Psychic. And yeah, what I do is I go back into movies uh, from the past and I analyze these for references to possibly uh, future information. And in the course of doing this, yeah, I find uh, there are many uh, strange references uh, to things that happened in the past. Alright, so in Monster Dog, uh, it looks like they're showing something about the actor Bruce Dern. And there are several actors in here who resemble him. And yeah, these include Alice Cooper himself. The gunman from the second half of the movie, Fernando Condi, uh, he's credited as Town Folk number two. He's the guy with the sunglasses and the bandolero and shotgun. I think he looks like Bruce Dern. There's an uncredited gunman in here. And I think that he is uh, actor Treat Williams and Bruce Dern from the 1996 movie Mulholland Falls. Once you have the key uh, that they may be talking about uh, Bruce Dern, okay, then uh, look for other possible references, and I'll share a couple of these. All right, so this actress, uh, she has the thick white coat and red pants. This is Pepita James, uh, plays the character Angela. Notice her purse. And it's a black and white uh, box style purse. And it has a picture of, I believe, Marilyn Monroe on it. All right, so Bruce Dern, he met Marilyn Monroe. This apparently occurred at the actor's studio. I guess this happened uh, before 1961. Uh, this applies to the film The Misfits. So yeah, the New York Post has an account of this. And Bruce Durney talks about how he's going to be in this movie Wild River. And this came out in 1960. But yeah, he says that Marilyn Monroe sat down next to him and said that she was going to be in Wild River. But she had to do uh, the Misfits instead because uh, her husband, Arthur Miller, uh, had wrote the script. So here's another one. Uh, this actress, she's Peppa Sarsa. Mary Lou. Okay, and I think that uh, she either resembles Catherine Hepburn or possibly uh, Boris Karloff or maybe uh, Yvonne Craig. All right, and yeah, there's a scene at the end of this movie. This is right before they escape the house. And she has uh, some lines. And, you know, to me, uh, she becomes, uh, she's channeling uh, Boris Karloff. All right, so I looked up uh, Boris Karloff and Catherine Hepburn, and it turns out, they were the owner of the same house. And this was in uh, Los Angeles. You can see this house. I think it's for sale now. A Los Angeles home where Catherine Hepburn lived early in her Hollywood career and Boris Karloff at the height of his career is for sale. That's what's on the ad. Bruce Dern, it turns out, he was in a television series with Boris Karloff. And this was the remarkable Mr. Hawk part of the Thriller series, Season 2, Episode 13, from December 18, 1961. And also in this was uh, John Carradine. I did a search on Bruce Dern and Catherine Hepburn, and I came up with this link, and it refers to the movie On Golden Pond, 1981. This starred Catherine Hepburn, TV movie. So this was referred to in a 1982 Saturday Night Live episode. This is on the NBC uh, television. In this episode, the guest star was Bruce Stern and uh, Luther Vandross was in this. And so they mentioned On Golden Pond in the course 
of uh, one of the skits uh, focus on film. Alright, so I'll give one other wink Bruce Dern and Monster Dog. Actress Victoria Vera, who plays Sandra, I couldn't help but notice that she resembled Karen Black. And Karen Black was in a movie with Bruce Dern, and this was the 1976 thriller mystery family plot. And uh, wow, I think that uh, these links uh, add up to something uh, rather significant. So you like my videos, you can contact me. My email address is eggguy at yahoo.com. YouTube channel Easter Egg Psychic. And thanks for watching.